what is up everybody welcome back to another episode of dragon speed shop where we've got a bunch of work done to uh this mustang um again kind of another recap i haven't had a lot of time to build but i did get some stuff done um talking to a buddy he kind of gave me the idea of making this the cleanest build that I've ever made um, when it comes to wiring anything like that so that's kind of what's been taking me a little bit longer worrying about the little itty bitty details um, stuff like that so let's take a look here ooh there's something hiding in there <clears throat> So, we have the motor. Um, let's talk here for a second and uh, kind of tell you what I've done. Um, very first thing I did is I cut the factory wheel wells out of this. Um, cut both sides. There's one. There's the other side. And then I fabricated these here um, just took them stuck them around a socket about the shape that I like put a little heat to them and uh, mock those in here um, when I went to go do the back firewall I didn't realize that the Mustangs firewalls was kind of on a slight angle towards the driver side so I didn't like that so I hacked that out and built this here um, fits the motor really really well um, <clears throat> you can see that motor I like the way it's centered I didn't want to bring it all the way back because um, that would have required me relocating the transmission mount I didn't feel like it no I actually like it this way um, the other thing I have in here is actually the radiator um, where it's going to mount um, then I have the front grill in here um, you can kind of see that front suspension we'll get into that here in a second focus but I'm really happy with the way this engine bay has turned out um, there's still a lot of work to do in here to smooth everything out make it nice um, you know put a nice bevel on here do a little bit more sanding um, I also want to make a radiator cover here They'll probably hide the intake and you'll just be able to see it um, but also in here I've got the you know you can see down in there there we go I've got the all the line or not the lines the, the pulleys and stuff everything in there um, trying to think of a way I want to do the intakes um, something kind of new and interesting there um, front suspension um, we can get this where it's supposed to sit everything's really kind of still sitting here um, just glued those on and they're not sitting right but <clears throat> you can see I have all oh, that was out of the camera um, you can see I have the coilovers in here now um, we take a look in here I still got to make a Kind of a mounting bracket for this so it's not sitting um, just kind of free floating there so when the tire actually sits where it's supposed to you're going to be able to see in there pretty well so i need to make that look legit as possible but it's coming along really nicely um, as you guys can see i have both sides of the fender flares they are all nicely sanded now um, really really happy with the way that uh, kind of wide body kit that I kind of fabbed up turned out um, really super stoked but that's about all I've done um, you know just a little bit of work here and there these weeks are just flying by but hope you guys uh, enjoyed this little tiny update on this but uh, until next time guys this is Dragon Speed Shop. I'm signing out. <clears throat>